Hi, for today's video, I will do something a bit different. I will go through the IQ Nexus speed test by Olav Dörum, which is the same guy that made the Mensa Norway IQ test. However, I didn't solve the puzzles before recording me going through them, so I will go through them live with a time limit of 8 minutes to solve them. By the way, the test is in PDF form, so you can't click on the answers and check which one is correct. To deal with this problem, I made a Google form out of the IQ test with clickable answers. So if you want, you can go to the form, start a timer of 8 minutes and see how many correct answers you're able to get within the time limit. Just to clarify, the answers on this form is what I think is correct and I don't know if it's officially correct. Okay, let's start the test. Uh, diagonal puzzle B. Diagonal puzzle E. Diagonal puzzle B. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. E. Uh, left side is repeated in the rows, right side in columns. A. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. B. A uh, plus sign is repeated in this diagonal and squares in this, B. So we see these lines, these type of lines are repeated in this diagonal. So it's either B or E and then triangles repeated here, so it's E. Uh, these type of shapes are repeated here. Uh, the squares are repeated in this, so it's C. Oh, uh, triangles, the, the triangle tips are repeated on this. So we will have a triangle tip, either A or E. And then these types of curved lines are repeated in this diagonal. So A. Uh, diagonal puzzle, smaller triangle, smaller circle. So we will have a square with a smaller square. D is correct. Oh, this one seems hard. Oh yeah, I see it. I guess a triangle plus this plus sign gives triangle plus plus sign. Uh, this uh, dot plus the dot and the circle, the dots cancel out, we have a circle. So square and triangle plus square gives only triangle left. So E is correct. Pointing up with these type of things, triangle to repeat here, C, C is correct. So that plus that is that, that plus that cancellation gives a circle. So this type of shape plus the circle plus the circle gives only that type of shape, C is correct. Simple addition, uh, so that plus that, that and that cancel out. We will have that and that, C is correct. Addition with cancellation, this cancel out with this. So we will have this plus this, D is correct. Uh, Another addition puzzle, so I expect, wait, is this addition puzzle? Yep. So, E. Addition with cancellation, the correct answer should be F. Yep. Addition with cancellation, the correct answer is F. Addition with cancellation, the correct, wait, is this with cancellation? It doesn't matter. The correct answer is C. Uh, the right side repeats on these diagonals. 
the left side you repeat on these diagonals. So we will have the square on the right side and the plus on the left side. And three is correct. So what do we have here? It seems like some kind of addition. So this weak line plus this stripled line gives a thick line. Weak line, I mean stripled line plus weak line gives a strong line. So it seems to be addition. Yep. Weak, stripled, strong. Strong, stripled, weak. Wait, does this also work in the columns? Uh, wait, the top repeats in the columns. Weak, 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 stripled, stripled, stripled. Ah, it's, you can just look in the columns. So you expect strong, strong line on the top and on this diagonal, stripled on the bottom. So answer C. Oh no, what is this? Three lines, three lines. So I would expect three lines in the last one. But I don't see how, how, how it makes sense. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna guess on E, because three lines, three lines, three lines, it has to be E, like, or B, but yeah, I'll, I'll gamble on E. Uh, the b bottom left repeats in the rows, top right repeats in the columns, C is correct. This looks like a column puzzle, I mean a diagonal puzzle. So we have this, it's rotated by 90 degrees clockwise. Then this smaller shape is stretched out. So, wait, it's stretched out. Okay, so here, this line is stretched out, I think. Wait. Uh, no, here, here, this one is stretched out and this one is rotated. So the ones on this diagonal should be rotated while the ones on this diagonal should be stretched out. So the answer should be this one rotated by 90, deg by 90 degrees clockwise, which matches A. So yeah, A, A was correct, probably. Uh, the correct answer is D. This looks some looks like some kind of cancellation. Two one one, three three zero, one two, one. C is correct. Uh, addition with cancellation. Uh, this cancels out. This cancels out. This cancels out. We have that, that, and that. B is correct. This in place and yeah, I'm gonna run out of time. I guess I'll, okay, A is correct. I'll allow myself a tiny bit of extra time and solve the last one. But otherwise this last one would have been wrong, I guess. Uh, so this looks like addition with cancellation. But where? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. In, in these diagonals, this plus this gives this, this plus this gives this, so this plus this gives a square with a square inside. A is correct. So yeah, that's how I go through it live. I'm gonna go back to puzzle what was it? This one. I think this is the only puzzle that I don't understand. Uh, 
Okay, so the plus sign, I guess, cancels out this corner and the other one this corner, and we get these lines and a line between this. But it doesn't make sense with this. Like, w w with the second uh, column, I would expect three vertical lines and not these three curved lines. But I guess it makes sense that we would have Okay, see, this one is the same height as this one, and this one is the same height as this one. So maybe one curved line and one straight line or something like that. I mean, this, these aren't really curved. Maybe F is correct. F gives two curved, two straight. But I, I, I still feel like E is correct, considering that we have 3, 3, 3. So that was the test. Let me know in the comments what you think about going through the tests live rather than solving them first and explaining my thoughts behind them. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. I will see you again in the next puzzle. Bye bye.